This is Barbie. And this is Ken. And today, we're going to be melting them. Hey guys, what's up? It's Andrea, and welcome back to my channel. I'm so, so happy that you guys are back this week. I feel like it's been a really long time since I've seen you. How's your life going? How is, how is your cat, dog, parakeet? Do any of you guys have parakeets? Today, what I wanted to do is something that I actually restocked in my store. So if, if you want to check that out, the link will be down below. But something that I restocked in my store last week, and it was called Melted Barbie and Ken. How I would describe it is like the colors of a melted Barbie and a melted Ken, but it's like a reverse avalanche kind of slime. So a lot of you guys loved it, a lot of you guys wanted to know how I made it, and that is what we're doing today. I hope that you liked my little intro section. Yeah, I'm gonna be honest, that was one of the weirdest things I've ever done for a video. Um, my neighbor stared at me a little bit. Hey, who is that person playing with Barbies in their front porch? me. But before you go, just a few things. The first one I've had in my mind for a while, but I'm just going to quickly like cover it here because I want to know what you guys think. Are you, comment down below, are you going to Playlist Live in Orlando this year? Let me know because I'm really thinking of going, but I'm really indecisive and I need you guys to tell me that you'll be there because I want to see you. I'm just scared. <laughs> if you like this video and you want to see more slime tutorials, maybe from my shop or different kinds of slime that you would like to see me make, then definitely give this video a thumbs up. It lets me know that you like this kind of thing so that I can keep doing more of them. You should definitely hit that subscribe button. It is right down there and while you're there you should turn on notifications because the notification fam is and will always be my favorite fam. You guys are amazing. Thank you for being here early. I'm talking to you right now watching this. Thank you for being here. If you turn on notifications, you get a chance to be featured in my notification shoutouts at the beginning of every video. Thank you guys, the ones that I've chosen this week. Thank you guys for being awesome and hanging out. Let's get on with the video. Okay, so for this tutorial, you totally don't need the Barbies. I just did it because I had them. And this is what we're going to be making. These ones I've left sit for a few days, so this is kind of what you're going to get. First you need two bowls, and they can be any size, so it's just what I had, a pink and blue spatula, some pink and blue food coloring, some clear glue, then we have some white glue for the bottoms of the reverse avalanches, and then we have some pink and blue acrylic paint. And finally, we have some bronze glitter. I got this one from Michaels. So first we're going to be making that white slime base. And I already have the pink one made up from the restock, so we're going to be using that. But I'm going to show you how to make the blue one real quick. So to do this, I took a bottle of white glue, a full bottle of warm water, shook that up to get all the glue out, and then mix that up. Then we're going to be activating it using one cup of warm water to about a third a teaspoon of borax and then mixing that till it's slime and that's the texture you're looking for it should be a very loose slime almost jiggly but not quite then we are going to be taking that blue acrylic paint and then just mixing it in until we get the color that we want like that <laughs> and then we are going to be taking a little bit the ratio for this when you're putting it in a container is I would say one third white slime to two thirds the clear glitter slime. So we're putting that in the bottom and then I just leave mine sit until they melt out. Do you know what I mean by melt out? They kind of just like spread out. And that was a very quick scene of me telling you I was making clear slime and then I separated that in two. <laughs> And we're going to be coloring that pink and blue, like I did right there. And then we're going to be taking that glitter and mixing a little bit in. I would say for the amount that I made, I probably should have put less glitter in, but you know what? The more glitter, the better. Am I right? <laughs> And putting some more glitter in the pink one so that we can get an even amount on both sides. Oh, this one's so pretty. 
Okay, so now what we are doing is just taking that clear glue slime and then putting it on top of the pink slime. Just try not to move it around too much when you're putting it in the container and that way you don't mess up the flat base you already have on the bottom. And then after, this was about two days, after about two days it starts to mold into itself and make kind of a reverse avalanche. You could also reverse this process and it would make an avalanche slime. Doing the same with the blue. And that's what it looks like when you first make it. And that's what it looks like on the bottom one there when you've let it set for a little bit. The glitter actually sets to the bottom too, which I thought was pretty cool. And here is the final product. If you recognize this video, it was totally taken out of my restocking video. A lot of you guys have been asking to rewatch the restocking videos. Would you be down if I made another channel just for my restocking videos and then left them up? Let me know down below. I've been thinking about doing. These are some really cool slimes. Like, it's cool because even when you mix them up, they still make something that looks really cool, you know? No Barbies died in vain. <laughs> And that was it. Did you guys like it? I really, really hope that you like these slimes. I think that they're so cool. And I don't know, I was just experimenting with different ideas for my shop last week. And I just thought this was a really fun summary idea. If you are planning on making this recipe, or if you have even made it already, definitely go ahead and let me know down below. Or send it to me on Instagram, or Twitter, or Snapchat, or whatever social media you have. All of mine will be linked down below. You should definitely show me what you've made. I would love, 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 love to see it. If you like this video, you should definitely go ahead and like the video like I said because it lets me know that you like things like this and I can make more videos like this. If you like me, you should subscribe to me because I make two new videos a week. One of them is always a slime video, a slime tutorial, a slime DIY, something involving slime. I have a lot of fun stuff planned. And then the next one is a DIY or a life hack or just something fun that's more real life. So I think both of them are really awesome and I would love to see you there. Also, while you are subscribing, you should definitely, like I said, go and hit notifications for a chance to be featured in my next video and my undying gratitude and love because I really appreciate you guys for doing that so, so much. Um, other than that, I will see you guys tomorrow. So definitely come back, hang out with me tomorrow and check that video out as well. Other than that, I love you guys so much and I will see you tomorrow. <laughs> I hope you have a great rest of your day. <laughs> Bye. Let's go party. Come on, Barbie. Let's go party.